dear traders, you're watching the latest link up on Insta TV. Today we will take a look at the current positions of currency pairs and we will try to forecast their further movements with technical analyst Petr Yakimovic. Hi Petr! First, let's take a look at the Euro-Dollar pair. What trading opportunities do you see on this pair today? Hello there, traders! On the Euro versus US Dollar, uh, we got a very um, good uh, opportunity uh, on this currency pair because I found basically there is a, a bullish divergence on the 480 minutes uh, chart um, and there is a bullish divergence on the, the 310 oscillator and also what I found is that level uh, uh, at 1.1264 held successfully and basically the euro tried, uh, tried to go below the support and um, it failed and then we got a nice rejection uh, of this support. So basically I expect further upward movement on this uh, currency pair and you should watch for buying opportunities on the deeps. Uh, the upward targets are set at the price of 1.1375. This is the first upward target. The second upward target is set at the price of 1.1420 and third target is basically set at the price of 1.1483. Again, um, bullish divergence, a nice bullish divergence on the pre-10 oscillator on the 480 minutes and the, um, the failed breakout of the 1.1264, which, uh, which was a good support. So watch for buying opportunities on the euro versus US dollar. What can you say about the pound dollar pair? Uh, similar like uh, that we got on the euro dollar, we got also on the British pound versus US dollar. Uh, there is a, also a bullish divergence on the 310 oscillator on the uh, 480 minute chart. And um, there is a, also even um, um, more evidence on the further upside because there is a breakout of the key supply trend line in the background, which is another big uh, sign uh, that uh, buyers are to uh, totally in control and that we got potential change in the trend dynamic from bearish to bullish. So what for buying opportunities? Uh, the key supported one, uh, the 1.2500 held successfully, so I expect further upward movement in potential test of the 1.2630. This is the first upward target and the second upward target at the price of 1.2730. Um, both targets are based on the previous price section and uh, uh, of course, you should watch for buying opportunities on dips, uh, not to buy near the high. So you know, so wait for some retracement on lower frames, and then try to be, establish your long positions. Last time, you made your predictions on the dollar yen pair. Uh, what can you say about this pair now? On the U uh, USD versus Japanese yen, uh, what I found is there is a breakout of the ABC pattern. And um, you know there is a breakout of this uh, support trend line, which is a very good sign for the further downside. Also, I found that there is a new momentum low on the 310 oscillator, which is a basically warning for the buyers, and uh, which is a something which give us a good um, confidence on the downside and the further downside on the USD versus Japanese yen. So. Again, key, so key resistance level on this uh, currency pair is at the price of 109. And um, as long as the USD Japanese yen is trading below the 109, you short for selling opportunities. And the target is set at the price of 106.78. Thank you, Petter, for your trading recommendations and see you back next week. You've watched the weekly link up on Insta TV. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to always keep in track with the latest events on financial markets. See you back soon.